Hey man, I'm Kevin Smith. This is the IMDb studio at Acura Festival Village. And look, it's the cast and crew of Downhill. Give it up for him, ladies and gentlemen. Um, for a movie with an insanely recognizable cast, the directors may be the two most recognizable people. Not Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, Thank it's you. crazy, it's man. It's important we start there. Yeah. It is very important we yeah. start there. Acknowledge that every day on set. Absolutely. <laughs> with um, that in mind, should we switch seats? Yeah, yes, feels, you should be on the power, like power level. Is there another row? Is there a third? <laughs> A row up there? Yes. We fold it up, man. Um, what, uh, it, it, the movie, walk people through the flick. I, I know it's, uh, tell people what it is. Uh, yeah, it's a remake of uh, the very popular um, Swedish film Force Majeure. Right. And uh, this is the American version of it. How about that? Do you want to know the premise? Yeah. Give okay. It. A family goes on a ski vacation. In our case, it's an American family in a European ski town. So far, so good. So far, so yeah. good. <laughs> yep. Yeah. This is the one I remember. Yep. Uh huh. Okay. Yep. They're having a great vacation. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. On uh, early on in the trip, however, they go to a mid mountain uh, restaurant to have some lunch. This is a Spoiler long. alert! Spoiler mm -hmm. alert! Spoiler alert! <laughs> They hear a big bang, they see uh, an avalanche coming towards them, and everybody gets out their phones, thinks it's all wonderful. And then it starts turning to, is this okay? Eventually turns to wide panic, everybody screaming, freaking out. The mother of the two uh, children in the family. That, that's me, that's played me. Played by Julia, Julia Dreyfus. Uh, huddles, protects her two kids, protect, you know, huddles down. The father, played by Will Ferrell. Will Ferrell. Uh, grabs his Dr. cell phone. Will Ferrell and runs away. Uh, <laughs> then the rest of the, you find out that it was just a big sort of plume of snow, nobody got hurt, it was totally fine, but it was terrifying, but right. no injuries. He comes back to the table, and the rest of the movie is really the fallout of what would you do if your spouse sort of ran away instead of staying with you. So you have to stand up for all men, and you really like just let us down by running away. This sounds oh. like a movie I'm gonna fight with my wife over yeah. after we oh, see yeah, it. Oh yeah, definitely, there will be, <laughs> Long, awkward, contentious car rides home. Yeah, like, would you uh, have ran? Exactly. I'll just tell her, hell yeah. Yeah. <laughs> would've, would've, if you own it, I think that's, that's, part of, that's one of the lessons of the Everyone movie, likes too. A confident coward. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> confident <laughs> coward, yeah. Um, where, so, did you guys see Force Majeure and you're like, oh my God, that'd be so much better if it was in English? Or did somebody, <laughs> did somebody come to you and go like, uh, hey man, what so about... Was Julia. Julia. Did you begin yeah. this? She began the whole thing. So process. not only are you the uh, actress, you're also the Finally, producer. Finally, somebody's talking to me. <laughs> She's producing. <laughs> hey lady, you brought eight people to my f***ing panel. I'll get to everybody. I didn't know we were allowed to So swear. wait a second, you're, you're producing on the... You were yeah, the one I'm that was... Yeah, producer. Well, yeah. done, man. So wait, you just, you're the one that's like, this is a make a ass movie. off. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, I was a huge fan of the Swedish film, of course, and then uh, Ruben Oslin, who made the film, was uh, very amenable, in fact, quite keen for us to make an American adaptation of it. And so we did exactly that. And, um, and I, I thought it would be really interesting to put an American spin on it and open up some of these characters in different ways. And, um, and yeah, lickety split, five years later, we got a movie. Um, five years, that's all it took. <laughs> yeah. um, did you reach out to these guys? Had you I worked did. with them before? Did you know their stuff? I had never worked with them before, and I will never work with them again. <laughs> <laughs> this this is the end of it all. This right is there. it. Yep. It's the last interview we'll ever sit near um, each other. What is it like working with directors who are also actors, and funny actors as well? Well, you mean, besides the, the idea that they're constantly trying to, like, steal my part? I mean, they're <laughs> always trying to do my lines and step into, right? Why did you run away? There was an avalanche coming. That was my A lot of line readings. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Jill, that's the part of Billy, by the way. Yeah, yeah he's doing yeah. my part right Pete, now. why did you run away? Yeah, see? You never get that performance from <laughs> One more take. Can we just? Can you do it more I, like this? I just dubbed it. You'll, you you'll ADR'd you'll a see lot of Julia's line. Julia yeah. stuff. <laughs> what? Um. Uh. What? The other, there are more than you people in the movie. Yeah. What? You were in both movies. <laughs> yes, I'm the alibi. I'm. 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 I'm the link between yeah, the two. Yeah, yeah, You're the man who walks between two worlds. Uh, so. But no. you didn't play the same part. No. Oddly he, enough, he, he took my you. part. <laughs> I can see the resemblance yeah. right away. Yeah, it's like Zach yeah. is the American Similar, Christopher. Yeah, take away all masculinity. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> um, was it like being there for it twice? Is it deja vu? It was. It was, but, but I, but I really enjoyed it, and I feel like this movie is something new. It's, it's new character experiencing the same thing, but it's, it's great and it's new. They won't let you get away from ice and snow, huh? No, 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 no. So uh, we're gonna cut my beard afterwards and see what's gonna happen. That's next, right? <laughs> Miranda, what do you do in this picture? Uh, I play Charlotte, um, a woman that they run into at the hotel that they can't really work out what, what she's all about um, and interact a lot with uh, Julia. And compare it to, say, Sabrina. Oh, compared to Sabrina? <laughs> uh, well, different accent. I'm German in this. Um, quite kind of um, sexually confronting, quite forward kind of character in your face. Yeah. Genius. Sexually confronting is such a great word, <laughs> phrase. <laughs> Zoe, what are you doing in here? Hi. Hi. <laughs> uh, I am part of a, a duo. Um, a, Zach's my boyfriend in this film, and we sort of are the foil to Billy and Pete's uh, more established relationship. And I play kind of a, a very confident uh, young person who speaks in hashtags. Uh, <laughs> so. a, lot of, a lot of like uh, Miranda's character, Charlotte, and then Rosie, who uh, Zoe plays, they're sort of function as they float into Billy's life as she's sort of uh, reeling from this moment. And they become these people who sort of start to her, make her question her individuality within this couple and if she is making sure she's still present in this marriage. So there's all these characters sort of float in, which is sort of nice. Uh, and then obviously Zach and Rosie represent it. They're in a different place as a couple. So it's a lot about where you are uh, as an individual with your partnership or your spouse or, or in any relationship where you can lose yourself. And I just got really real. For me, therapy oh. is about... <laughs> <laughs> you did, I was Whoa. sitting there going like, no wonder he won an Academy Award, Mr. So. Hoity Toity. From an early childhood, I knew oh. I had issues. <laughs> oh. um, yeah. The, um, you guys, have you ever worked together before, the two of you? No. no. This was the first time? And we'll never first do it again. Yeah, exactly. No, we will definitely work together yeah. again, but uh, not with you not guys. Not with these guys. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We've got about uh, like 10 projects yeah, lined, lined up. up. Yeah. What is it like no. being married to Veep? Uh, it <laughs> Good old Veep. I would call you Veep a lot. Uh, I wouldn't yeah. even call you Selena. I'd call you Veep. Yeah, which I appreciate it. What's up, Veep? <laughs> yeah. Um, it was super funny. It was super funny. Because I didn't, I didn't let go of the bit. Will, what were some of the other fun practical jokes that we had oh. on set? <laughs> well, there was this one time when... Can I get another mic, actually? Yeah. Thank right, you. Go, go. That we had such a fun t time. Um, we, we actually just kind of hit the ground running. We, we had... Yeah. We met uh, on this movie, for yeah. this movie, and it's actually bizarre that we'd never... We'd actually never even met before, and we yeah. have these sort of parallel... It lives in right. the business, yeah. and um, but as soon as we met, I feel as if we were immediately connected kind of and and of like sharing mind. the same brain. Yeah, mm -hmm. right. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yes. You have spent time with you. I. By like, the way, is this going to raise my star meter yes. rating? Yeah. Appearing on you this? just went up three points with four oh, mics in your face. Okay. They're going to take that and crack. Photoshop and replace all those mics with other uh, the other things right in your face. <laughs> um, the you I know. Because I've worked with you, I sat next to the first time I watched um, uh, Book of Mormon in New York, and you were with your husband and your kid, and I was thrilled. The show's amazing, but yeah. I was thrilled because, like, I'm an old SNL fan, and I remember when he hosted the news and shit, yeah. and I remember like when you guys got together. I was like, that's so cute. You guys are still together at this point. Well, as of this moment. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he hasn't seen the movie yet. So he hasn't seen the seen movie. That's where it goes yeah, downhill. Yeah, exactly. Um, do you bring anything from married and mom life to the role at all, or no? Oh, tons, yeah. I think we both did. But yeah. Both Will That's and I right. have... That's right, you're a mom as well. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, but we've both been married a really I'm long time. I'm right and, now. <laughs> <laughs> and we both have kids, and... Um, yeah, do you want me to get the pump? <laughs> Are you can, good? Can we get the pump standing by? <laughs> really hard, right? Yeah, <laughs> real hard. <laughs> what yeah, pump pressure. too much yesterday. Yeah. Um, what, uh, what is it like working for guys that have won an Academy Award? Do you find yourself going, I better I, listen? I'm going to tell you something. I am baffled as to how they pulled that off. <laughs> Yeah, it is jaw-dropping. It's jaw-dropping. It's that. stunning. How is this even possible? I guess they just but, hand know, them out to anyone. They give them know? away for free <laughs> these days. Are we supposed so, to be here for this part of it? Or? <laughs> you were so intimidated by me when we first met. <laughs> because of the Oscars. Yeah. 
Yeah. They they bring the Oscar. Not because you're like, you were in Beer Fest. They put it on top of the monitor at Video yeah. Village. Right there? They just set it. Mm-hmm. And then you give line readings. Yeah. Right, yeah. and they just point at the statue. Just point. Yeah. If yes. you disagree at all, they just point to the statue. <laughs> right. I'm gonna hit you guys with some fast questions. Ready? Mm-hmm. Everybody's got to answer. Okay. Starting right here. Yeah. What is the last show that you binged? The last show that I binged. Yeah. Um, We're not gonna start with you. Take We're your gonna time. start with Christopher. Uh, Apparently, Will needs to think. The Good Wife. Did you? Yes. Right on, man. Nobody said that yet. Excellent poll, Miranda. Don't f- with cats. Yes. Don't f- with cats. Don't f- with cats. It was a good binge. It was a good binge. I just that's only three. I it's only started three to long. try to do it last night, but it's, I got it's too, too scared it's about, about. It's about the really beginning. hard. It's too scared. Last chance, you. What is it? It's this really cool documentary series about a com- a community college football. It's. I know that I just pitched it really badly, but it's <laughs> no, mind blowing. Didn't awesome. you think it was yeah. awesome? Yeah, so good. Yeah, and, and I don't even like football. Uh, Rachel Maddow. You <laughs> binged every episode? That show, yes. <laughs> God, you loved it. What was your oh. favorite part? Oh, where um, she uh, forgets to uh, that she's wearing a wig, and uh, the, and then they they have to go to commercial break, and she has to change it, and uh, it everyone is just up in arms. <laughs> Classic Rachel Maddow episode. Um, Six. Succession. A shout out to our partner, Jesse oh, Armstrong. Yes. Yeah. Succession. Who was, uh, wrote on this. So J- the guy who created Succession? Yes. Jesse Armstrong. Yes. He wrote one the One of the writers. Yes. One of the writers yes. on the script. Right yes. on. Classy. A lot of people have been saying Succession. Oh, cool. In this way where I'm like, didn't you f- watch it when it happened? No, I know. Like everyone's I was, catching I up to it. was late in the game, yeah. Well done. Late way to come to along. Well, I was going to say Succession, which is true. So I did Succession and I did Fleabag for the second time. Oh, so good, right? So. Didn't it make you want to like quit? You're yes, like, it did. It actually then, did. It but made... What about the real ones that you actually do watch a lot? Let's oh, talk about those. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess for me, Price is Right is fun to sort of binge. Uh, Fantasy Jeopardy. Island. I... <laughs> Remington Steel. The, the you 70s. Went back to, what did you, you say? Love Remington Island. Steel. Love <laughs> yeah, the Bachelor, House. like Basketball. Love Island one. Oh, I, oh, I, I absolutely actually would. So. The, uh, yeah, Terrace House. Does what anyone is know about this? No. What is no. it? House. What is, it is the opposite of Love Island. It is the most subdued reality TV show that oh. takes place in Japan where they're all in a house and you wait for them to make a move on each other, but nothing really... Kill like, each other? Uh, <laughs> not, uh, no. no. To, to like make yeah. out or something. Okay. Yeah, we okay. don't know, maybe in another season. Just, just but yeah, it's yeah, so like, tame. Must be murder. Yeah. It's like the quietest, yeah. tamest like sex, reality. Sexually non-confrontational. Ex- yeah. yeah, sexually non-confrontational. Um, I've been watching these YouTube videos by this guy, Badlands Chugs. Are you familiar with Badlands no, Chugs? What is it? He's this guy who has like a million followers on YouTube and his big claim to fame is he'll chug liters of soda so much. And his, <laughs> and his thing, it comes out and says, Badlands Chugs, hungry and focused since 1997. <laughs> but he's obviously in his 40s, so I don't know what was happening before 1997. But anyone who's watching, please watch Badlands Chugs. <laughs> Binge worthy indeed. Um, what is the one prop that you've stolen from a set? Ooh. Um, I just recently did for a Halloween costume. I stole uh, one of those. I was a TSA agent for Halloween, and I stole one of those wands that goes... Oh, nice. Yep. You stole it from where? Don't worry about it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> your business. Yep. That's why the budget was so high. Yeah. You. I can't even think I've ever stolen... Um, oh, just because so I virtuous. feel like it's my responsibility to respect the prop master, yeah. to respect the <laughs> I'm sure cash. I'm sure I stole cash. I'm sure you've stolen someone's heart. Um, oh, that's dear. God. <laughs> God, I've missed you. Zoe, you're not calling uh, me anymore. These three earrings on my uh, left ear were costumes. I didn't mean to take them. I promise. Um, but they're still home. in there, yeah. So, Zach, um, just like if Cass, if like we we'll leave like uh, keepsakes and stuff, and like stuff that's personally important to them but irrelevant to everyone else. <laughs> they're not props. They're not actual props. No, just I mean they're props of the people's interior lives. Yeah, and I'll take those and because I just want to deprive them of a little bit of joy. Badlands Chugs. Badlands Chugs, hungry and focused. <laughs> Since 1997. <laughs> <laughs> I'm giving you the No, I stole a water bottle. 
The water bottle? No, uh, From Game uh, of Thrones? Uh, a. A water a bottle. bottle yeah. <laughs> Starbucks coffee cup. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what about you? I have a sword from Lord of the Rings. Did you really mm. take one? Did you I bring it today? Sword. I did. No, I didn't. Oh. Couldn't get it through security. <laughs> <laughs> Amazon's doing it again. They're doing a big like Lord yeah, of the Rings. Yeah, I heard band. that. For you, do you go like uh, I'm? I'm curious to see if somebody else is going to play me, or do you think they give you a call? I think it's pre um, where we were it in takes the movie, place so my character probably didn't exist. At so that do you point. have a rooting interest, or you're like I don't give a sh if I don't exist in that world? F that. Sh no, I'd like to see it. I'd like to see what they do with it. I think they're shooting it in New Zealand, so yeah, that'll yeah, be yeah. interesting. Very cool. Yeah. yeah. Uh, what about you, Liz? Uh I stole the Resolute desk from the Oval Office. Oh. You did not. <laughs> How do you steal something that big? No, I did it. <laughs> <laughs> Will? I, I don't think I stole it. I think I arranged to keep it. But uh, my uh, when I did the episodes of The Office, my Dundee Award. Oh, that's so I have you a Dundee. You have your Dundee? Nice. Yeah. Um, all right, I'm going to ask you one more, man. Uh, I'll cross the boards, then I'll let you go. Who should play you in a biopic? Go, fast. Oh. Don't give it a lot of thought. Oh. oh. Uh, I just said, Helms. don't give it a lot of thought. There you go. Excellent job. Moby. Excellent pull. Um, uh, uh, Constance Wu. <laughs> uh, Paul Ryan. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, that's good. That's too good. That's good. Sadly. <laughs> Christopher. Uh, so this is the loan. Nice. The young one. No, the old one. Current one. <laughs> Miranda. I've always said Hillary Clinton, but I'm a bit nervous because she's here now to say <laughs> Now's the time to hit her up about it. I don't know if you're busy. Serena Williams. Yeah. Can you pull it off? I see it. Yeah, yeah she, could pull, she can do anything. Yeah, that's true. Good yeah. point. Chad Smith or Ron Perlman? <laughs> A little bit of Ron Perlman. Had you on Chad Smith, Ron Perlman? A little bit? The Beast, Ron Perlman? Yeah, The Beast. <laughs> I mean, right? I guess, like, a, no, Maybe? no, just oh, for okay. height, that's it. All right, never mind. The Chad thing, I think Strike you got that it from off. the record. <laughs> <laughs> the movie is called Downhill, ladies and gentlemen. Give it up for the cast and crew of Downhill. Yeah.